What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we are at McDonald's to get their new Cardi B and Offset meal. So they are releasing this for Valentine's Day. Today is actually V-Day whenever I'm filming this. I'm not sure when you guys are going to see this video. It's definitely going to be after Valentine's. So I hope you all had a wonderful Valentine's Day regardless of who you spent it with. But yeah, this meal. So I saw that they were coming out with this on the Super Bowl. I think that's when they announced it. McDonald's dropped pretty big commercial with Cardi B and Offset. Whenever I saw it, I was like, okay, yes, you obviously know I gotta do a video. For me, where I live, the meal is $13.99. It comes with a cheeseburger and a Coke and a barbecue, which is Cardi B's portion of it. And then Offset's portion is the quarter pounder with cheese large fry between the two of them, an apple pie, and I think ketchup, and a high C. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Hi, I have a quick question. Do you guys have the bags for the Offset and Cardi B meal? Well, we have the Cardi B and Offset. Do you, mean the, do you mean the bags that the food is? Yes. Yes. Okay, perfect. Can I get that meal then? Um, I'll do the ones that it comes with, the high C, and I think a Coke. And it can, it can be any drink we want. It has to the Okay, yeah, no, that's fine. That's gonna be it. Okay, thank you. Okay, so after tax, it was $14.93, so about $15. And this is supposed to be for two people. So I don't know, I think it really depends on how big your appetite is. Obviously you can just get this for one person, but it is a lot of food for one person. I mean, it just depends, like I said, how big your appetite is. I think between Gabe and I, I don't know. I'm not sure. I think I would be okay eating this and splitting it with him, but I think Gabe <laughs> would be a little bit hungry after eating this. But it comes with one apple pie. I think maybe they should have done two apple pies or they could have done an apple pie and a sundae. If this meal came with a sundae, I would be all over that. I went to Chick-fil-A the other day and got an ice cream cone. Their ice cream does not hit like McDonald's, but I forgot how good it was to just come to a fast food joint and get an ice cream cone. Like it really is delicious. But yeah, Valentine's Day, such a good time of the year. I love all the pinks and the reds and all of that. I just think Valentine's Day is a lot funner if you have children. Can I reach this window? I think I can. No one's there. Okay. Yeah, so I think Valentine's Day is a lot funner when you have children because... It's already be offset now. Yes. Oh my gosh, your shirt. I love that. Thank you. I wish they sold those. Yeah. <laughs> this is the first one of those meals I've sold today. I've, 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 I've really? a lot of them. Oh, dang. Thank you. You're welcome. Wow, I'm the first Cardi B and offset meal. <laughs> that they've sold today that's funny i mean it is i don't know i guess i thought it would be more popular but they just opened for lunch two hours ago so that might be why uh, was you the one who was saying you wanted the bag yes okay pull to the next one is she going to check oh, okay thank you thank you she's going to check but y'all told me y'all have them Oh gosh, I hope they have them. Okay, let's wait right here. Yeah, honestly, the only reason why I'm getting this is because of the bag. It doesn't come with anything special. That's why I just, I don't know how I feel about these meals at McDonald's. It doesn't come with anything. Now the BTS meal was cool because you got the, the new dipping sauces, but every other meal that's come out, it's just been the same stuff that they have on their menu. Okay, anyways, we'll see if I get the bag or not. But like I was saying, Valentine's Day is so much better as a kid. Or if you have kids, because the stuff that you can buy for kids 
is just so adorable. Now, you can get this stuff, I guess, for a girl or a guy. I mean, either one. But I just know, like, for me and Gabe, I wouldn't buy him cute little plushies and stuffed animals because he's not into that sort of thing. He could buy it for me, but, like, I want to buy that for someone. I want to buy a kid that adorable Valentine's Day stuff that they come out with. So I just think it'd be a lot funner having kids and my parents would always get us the cutest little Valentine's Day gifts. They did that for Easter too. Easter and Valentine's Day. We always got really cute themed items and I just, I miss that. All right, well, I guess I'm gonna wait on my food. Cross your fingers for me. I really hope I get this bag. Thank you so much. You too. We got the bag, you guys. The Offset and Cardi B meal has been secured. Oh yes, I am so excited. I almost was gonna ask her if I could buy one of the t-shirts. So the girl at the first window that took my money, she was wearing a Cardi B and Offset McDonald's t-shirt. Obviously it was just like a crew t-shirt because it said crew on it, but I wish I could buy one of those. I guess there's no way for them to, <laughs> to sell that to me, but how awesome would it have been to buy one of those? Oh, I want one. I still have my McDonald's uniforms <laughs> from working at McDonald's. They're at my parents' house, but yeah, I kept all those. I think, I'm pretty sure I did. Okay, where am I gonna park at? All right, you guys, we are now parked and I have my Cardi B and Offset meal. I really like their logo and the way the packaging looks. So there's the front. We got cute little hearts on the side. And then on the back, it says, will you share this meal with me? And then you can put your name and your boo's name or your friend, your kid, whoever you're sharing the meal with. <laughs> so I really like the bag. Super freaking adorable. We love it. Okay, let me actually take food out <laughs> so we have our high c fanta right no fanta and high c is definitely different i think honestly i'm not quite sure but okay not my favorite drink ever then we have our coke coke's a lot better <laughs> we got our large fry Mmm. McDonald's fries always hit the spot. We got our apple pie. Our cheeseburger for good old Cardi B. Our quarter pounder with cheese for good old Offset, which this is my kind of speed. Cardi B, you kind of letting us down with the cheeseburger. Is that really all she's getting when she comes to McDonald's? I don't know. <laughs> and then we got our barbecue sauce. So I didn't get any other sauces just because I wanted to get exactly how the meal came. So it comes with barbecue sauce. That's what Cardi B likes to dip her cheeseburger in. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, her cheeseburger definitely came with more stuff on it, didn't it? Or maybe the cheeseburger just looks way better in the picture probably i guess yeah the cheeseburger that's exactly how it comes it just looks so much better in the picture but that's food for you everything always looks way better in the picture okay can you guys see our food here so i'm gonna dive into cardi b's cheeseburger first with the barbecue sauce I don't think I've ever dipped their cheeseburger in the barbecue sauce, so let's see how this is. Pretty good dipped in the barbecue. Mm. I think if it was any other barbecue, I wouldn't like it, but McDonald's barbecue is very, it's more of a savory barbecue sauce. Cause you know, some barbecue is really thick and sweet. McDonald's is more of a thinner, saltier barbecue. Oh. 
Okay. Yeah, I don't know about this drink, you guys. Do y'all like the high C for McDonald's? I definitely don't think this is Fanta. Let me see. Hey Siri. Is Fanta different than high C? Okay, well that didn't help at all. So thanks for nothing. High C orange lava burst. Yeah, high C and Fanta is definitely different. McDonald's, you need to get Fanta. What are you doing with this high C? That ain't that good. Okay, now let's bite into our quarter pounder with cheese. Is this the deluxe? No. It was supposed to. No. Hold on. Wait. Now I'm confused and I just did a McDonald's video and got the deluxe. This is just the regular quarter pounder with cheese though. It's not the deluxe I don't think. I can't keep up you guys. Oh yeah, the deluxe is so much better. This is not the deluxe. This has to be the regular. Let me double check. Mm -hmm. Tastes so good though. Okay, yeah, it's just a regular quarter pounder with cheese, not the deluxe. So he doesn't like the deluxe. He likes the regular. Interesting. I feel like you can tell a lot about a person by the burger they get. <laughs> I'm assuming Offset does not dip his quarter pounder in the barbecue, but let's try it. Dipped in there. Mmm. That's really good. I really wish I had some hot mustard. Okay, that's delicious. That's really delicious. Okay. I'm only using these two napkins. That's it. Got to keep those right here. I got extra napkins. Stashing them in my car. <laughs> okay, so... I know Burger King did celebrity meals, but I'm gonna need Burger King to do better. Burger King really needs to work on their marketing. They need to, uh, get some good celebrities. I think last year they did, was it last year? I think so. Last year or the year before, they did a few celebrities, but they were really small celebrities. I didn't quite recognize their names. Burger King needs to jump on the bandwagon and get some good celebrities. They need to do country celebrities. A Morgan Wallen meal? Oh my gosh, I'd go crazy for that. My friend really got me into Morgan Wallen. She loves him, and she was like, yeah, I actually like him better than Luke Combs now. And I was like, what? You like him better than Luke Combs? I'm a big Luke Combs girl. And when she said that, I was like, okay, I guess I need to check him out. He's pretty good. I'm assuming if you like country music, you probably already know who he is. But if you haven't heard of him and you like Luke Combs or other country music, yeah, you need to check out Morgan Wallen because his music is a vibe. Okay, let's try our apple pie. I honestly think this is going to be better than 
the strawberry kind because just based on how it looks it looks better than the strawberries and cream pie that I had in my video not that long ago this is honestly very similar to the meal that I had in that video <laughs> mm-hmm this is really good okay this is actually a lot better than the strawberries and cream pie which is kind of crazy I used to love the strawberries and cream pie way more than the apple but I guess since they changed the recipes around this one kind of has a better texture to it Yeah, this is really good. Mmm. Okay. Cardi B and Offset coming through. Mm. Speaking of Valentine's Day and like romance and stuff, I watched a show recently on Hulu called Tell Me Lies. Let me know if you guys have seen that show. I feel so conflicted with that show like I can't tell if I like it or not it's based on a book but the two main characters Lucy and Steven they are the most unlikable characters ever and for me if I'm watching a show and I don't like the main characters it makes me dislike the show so I don't know if like apparently they're coming out with a second season I don't know if I'm gonna watch the second season and if you haven't seen it I don't think I'd recommend it Overall, it's a pretty good show and it's interesting, but I just can't get over my dislike for the main characters. They're so awful. <laughs> They're so terrible. They're terrible to each other. They're terrible to all of their friends. And I'm just like, dude, I don't think you could make two characters more unlikable. That author, whoever wrote the book, I don't know what she was doing with those characters. But yeah, let me know if you guys have seen that. Again, it's called Tell Me Lies on Hulu. Oh, that 90s show. Did you guys watch that? So I actually saw a YouTube video of someone ripping the show apart. And everyone in the comment section was hating on the show. But I thought it was so good. I love that 70s show. And so I was really excited for this uh, kind of like spinoff. I really liked it. Now granted, it's very Disney show vibes. I saw someone in the comment section say that and I totally agree. It definitely makes you think of a Disney Channel show, but it's still so freaking cute. So let me know if you guys have watched that and if you like <laughs> that 90s show. I just think it's adorable and I really hope they make a second season of it. Honestly, I hope they make multiple seasons of the show because I just... I thoroughly enjoyed it okay well I think that's gonna be it for this video you guys I didn't want this to be too long I'm trying to like make my videos a little shorter I don't know if you guys like the really long videos but sometimes I feel like they're too long I don't know but I just don't want to keep droning on and on and on so I hope you all enjoyed seeing me try the Cardi B and offset meal overall I'm gonna give this maybe a 7 out of 10. I love you guys so, so much. Please drop a thumbs up down below, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.